Hello everybody and welcome to Tech in 5 Minutes. Today we'll discuss how to prevent DDoS attacks. Watch this video to know which DDoS attacks affected Twitter, Reddit, the New York Times, and PayPal at once. On our channel, we share thoughts on recent developments in the tech industry. Subscribe not to miss new videos. Let's start. So what is a DDoS attack? A distributed denial of service DDoS attack is a malicious attempt to disturb the normal traffic of a targeted server, service, or network. This is often done by overwhelming the target with a flood of internet traffic. In other words, DDoS can take down a server by sending too many requests for information, exposing it, and hampering on an organization's usual business operations. According to a survey from NetScout, over 10 million DDoS attacks were launched last year. Hackers unleashed DDoS attacks on government, healthcare, financial, e-commerce companies, streaming services, and others, disrupting business operations. Let's take a real example of domain name system provider, DIN. It was assaulted by a one terabit per second traffic flood that then became the new record for a DDoS attack at that time. On the map, you can see internet outages in Europe and North America caused by the DIN cyber attack. DIN lost 8% of its business as a result. It took down the world's largest internet services in a single weekend. Twitter, Reddit, The New York Times, and PayPal were among the giant websites that were affected. Can you remember any other big DDoS attacks? Do drop your comments in the comments section below. There are different types of DDoS attacks. They include volumetric attacks. This is the most popular DDoS where a bot overwhelms the network's bandwidth by flooding it with numerous fake requests on every available port. As a result, the network rejects regular, legitimate traffic. According to Arbor Networks, 65% of DDoS attacks are volumetric in nature. The next type is application layer attacks. They target the application itself, focusing on specific vulnerabilities or issues, resulting in the application not being able to deliver content to the user. It directly affects web traffic by targeting the HTTP, HTTPS, DNS, or SMTP protocols. From our experience at Jelvix, this type of attack is usually difficult to detect and fix because it easily imitates real online traffic. Make sure you read our guide on ensuring B2B software security. The link is in the description box. And the third type is protocol attacks. They are typically directed at network components that are used to validate connections. They work by delivering pings that are intentionally sluggish or faulty, causing the network to consume a lot of memory during the verification process. Protocol attacks can also target firewalls by transmitting massive amounts of purposely erratic data. Let's now review the five ways to prevent DDoS attacks. First, create a denial of service response plan. We at Jelvix recommend going over your system and identifying any potential security flaws, as well as outlining a clear response from your company in the event of a DDoS attack. Next, secure your infrastructure with DDoS attack prevention solutions. Firewalls, network monitoring software, antivirus and anti-malware applications, and threat monitoring systems are all examples of important security tools. Use them to monitor your network's baseline traffic and set up alarms for unusual activity. Our next tip is to understand the warning signs. Here are a few warning signs to watch out for. Slowing down of the network, your website goes offline, or suddenly, you're getting a lot of spam. All of these things could indicate a DDoS assault, requiring you to take immediate action. Next, adopt cloud-based service providers. Now, even though adopting the cloud will not completely prevent DDoS attacks, it will help to alleviate them. This is because the cloud has more bandwidth than on-premise resources, and the cloud structure means that many servers are not in the same location. And finally, monitor for unusual activity. This way, your company will detect and neutralize a DDoS attack in real time. Before we go, we want to know, what security tools do you recommend using? Drop your thoughts in the comments section below. Also, 
Share which topics we need to cover next in our videos. This video was prepared by the Jelvix team. Jelvix helps top brands worldwide to innovate and accelerate digital transformation. We provide world-class enterprise software engineering, design, and technology consulting services. Find our contact details in the description box. Thank you for watching this video. We share the latest news about tech trends and innovations, so make sure to subscribe not to miss a single video. And don't forget to press the subscribe button. Bye for now.